Hello and welcome to another training module from Cloudmasters Inc. The world of software development is in constant flux, always seeking more efficient and scalable solutions. Monolithic architectures, once the backbone of software development, are giving way to a more agile and flexible approach, microservices. In a microservice architecture, applications are broken down into small, independent services that communicate with each other over a network. This approach offers a plethora of benefits from increased agility and scalability to improved fault isolation and faster deployment times. Each microservice can be developed, deployed and scaled independently, allowing teams to work autonomously and deliver value faster. The shift towards microservices is driven by the need for speed and agility in today's fast-paced digital landscape. Businesses are demanding faster release cycles, greater scalability and increased resilience. Microservices, with their independent and modular nature, provide an elegant solution to these demands. They allow development teams to break down complex applications into manageable components, fostering faster development cycles and more frequent deployments. However, this new paradigm also presents unique challenges, particularly in the realm of security. As the attack surface expands with the proliferation of services, securing a microservices architecture requires a different mindset and a set of specialized tools. This is where DevSecOps comes into play, advocating for the integration of security practices throughout the entire software development lifecycle. DevSecOps is not just a buzzword. It's a cultural shift and a set of practices that are essential for building secure and resilient microservices architectures. In the traditional software development lifecycle, security was often treated as an afterthought, a separate stage tacked on at the end of the development process. DevSecOps breaks down these silos, integrating security practices from the very beginning and throughout every stage of the development lifecycle. This integrated approach is particularly crucial in a microservices environment where the distributed nature of the architecture introduces new security challenges. With multiple services communicating over a network, securing each microservice and their interactions becomes paramount. DevSecOps addresses these challenges by embedding security into the development process, ensuring that security is not an afterthought, but an integral part of the development culture. One of the key principles of DevSecOps is automation. By automating security checks and tests, organizations can ensure that security is embedded in every stage of the development pipeline. This not only improves the security posture of the application, but also frees up developers to focus on what they do best, building great software. The benefits of adopting a DevSecOps approach extend beyond just improved security. It also leads to faster development cycles, reduced costs and improved collaboration between development, security and operations teams. In the world of microservices, security cannot be an afterthought. It needs to be woven into the very fabric of the architecture from the outset. This is the essence of security by design, a principle that advocates for considering security implications at every stage of the design and development process. One of the key aspects of security by design is the principle of least privilege. This means that each microservice should only have access to the resources and data it absolutely needs to function. This limits the potential damage in case of a breach, as a compromised service will only have access to a limited subset of data and resources. Another important aspect is the use of API gateways. API gateways act as a single entry point for all requests to the microservices, providing a centralized point for implementing security measures such as authentication, authorization, and rate limiting. This helps to protect the underlying microservices from direct attacks and simplifies the overall security management. Microservice isolation is another crucial element of security by design. By isolating microservices from each other, you can limit the impact of a security breach in one service from cascading to others. This can be achieved through various techniques, including network segmentation, containerization, and the use of service meshes. Kindly like, share, and follow for more contents on your cloud journey. See you next time.